What's up, everybody? Richard and Nat. This guy would last two <laughs> two minutes in Hollywood. Two minutes he'd last in Hollywood. Oh, my God. Why can't I stop? It's just so fucking annoying. Two minutes in Hollywood. All right. This guy let's go. Last. Woo! Let's do it. <laughs> oh, that was my, frightening. My kids are sleeping. Uh, <laughs> That's that, probably a bad idea. That was frightening. All right. I'm good. All right. What's up, everybody? Richard and Adam, True Shot, back today for another reaction video. Today, we are checking out our Patreon poll winner of the week. This is Make Them Suffer and their track, Let Me In. Uh, this is going on seven years old at this point. Uh, this is an older track. I wonder if this is back in, like, their deathcore days. Um, I'm excited to check it out. This is our Patreon poll winner of the week. When did they get started? Slide. I don't know. Um, they're, they're, they've been around for a little bit, but I'm not okay. sure quite when. But, um, but yeah, let's, uh, let's check it out. This is right, Make Them go. Suffer. Let me in. Oh, is it going to be an emotional one? Genty as hell. There's triplets in there. A little funky. So good.
Oh. Damn, dude. All right. Uh, that was Make Them Suffer. Let Me In. That was heavy. In, 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 a, in, in both a, ways, in, yeah. In, yeah, in, in subject and in uh, listening delight. Um, I really like the cor- the screaming choruses. Uh, one of my loves is piano in, in this type of music. Mm. Uh, Rich can attest to that. Um, I get... Uh, I would have piano in all of our songs if I could. Yeah. But uh, he won't let me. That's not true. But uh, (laughs) I like that. I like that. Heavy subject. I was not expecting the end. Um, Yeah. I, I, in terms of like an interpretation of what the the song's message was, visually anyway, what I got was uh, a woman who is. Obviously, she's older, but I think that it's a flashback to yep. uh, it's like a domestic violence incident, and I think that uh, she eventually decided to leave, and as a result of that, because the guy was obviously a drinker and whatnot, and as a result of her leaving, the guy killed himself, and even though he was treating her in that way, it looked like she still felt guilty because he killed himself. Yeah, and That's kind of the, 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 the message that I got out of it. I could be totally wrong, but... That's how I interpreted it, especially because she, uh, you know, it just looked like, you know, she was injured. Reflecting right. back in the same place where the event had occurred. Right, exactly. So that's the that's the vibe that I got out of it. Yep. I, I know that people in the in the Twitch chat are talking about checking out the lyrics, which I definitely will. Um, but yeah, no, man, I thought that was a, just a really great, captivating performance, a great song. Um, like people in the chat are talking about, it's like Constance or Donna before Constance or Donna, you know, it's yeah. like that same sort of, yeah. uh, vibe and message. And I, I thought it was really, I thought it was really well done. I, I, d- I, I would that. agree. I want, what year was that? 2014. Okay. So, I mean, that's not, I mean, it's newer, but yeah, yeah. I mean, for I, it, it, this style of music, it's kind of like right in the heart. Yeah. I, I, I gotta be honest, like with make them suffer their death core style. I wasn't too, too into, but when they go like this style or I like, like or like how to survive a funeral that in that yep. realm, I really like it a lot, but, um, uh, all right. Well, anyways, as you can see all around us, we got all of our using all of our social media, as well as our Twitch and Patreon, all those links are below and until the next one, peace.